Yeah, hi YouTube. Something very bad happened to me today. Um, I accidentally, well, crapped up the fuse bits of this 1890 CAN controller. Um, and while I did this, I disabled the JTAG interface and uh, I set the external clock source to external clock. Source of the problem was that um, I seem to have a problem with um, the external uh, crystal oscillator which just doesn't want to swing and while playing around with fuse bits I accidentally used the wrong fuse bits that's very bad and um, now the problem is it's held into reset which shouldn't because the brownout detector was shitted up too but this shouldn't be that much of a problem when it comes to ISP programming because um, the system is in reset while ISP programming so and what I did is um, used um, an external clock source. You can see this here. Uh, this is uh, the external clock source um, generated by this um, waveform generator here. And I handed, <laughs> I wired um, the ISP interface onto the board because um, there is no ISP on that board because I thought I didn't need it. Well, usually you don't need it if you have JTAG and use JTAG. Yeah, but um, whatever I did, it wasn't successful, which means that I'll have to take it out completely and put in a new MCU. The well, problem with that is that, well, I don't have one of those uh, CPU MCUs in stock anymore. That's the bad thing. Also, this expensive 1890 can. Yeah, well, I have to do something here. Well, maybe some some one of you may have a problem, uh, a suggestion here for my problem, but I know that probably you won't have, but yeah. The wiring is correct, I double checked this. Um, the clock is 6 MHz, which should be sufficient. I used the SDK 500 for programming and I used the JTAG eyes in ISP mode, oh, so I tried them both. Doesn't work. Hmm. Bad. Yeah, that's, that's some of the things that happen sometimes. Couldn't happen though with uh, the new X Mega processors because you can't, uh, well, damage the fuses there because stuff like this couldn't happen. I mean, Admiral got the clue, and you see, this is it's the first time that really happened to me like this. But um, well, I guess there's this first time for everything, huh? Well, see you soon.